Hey y'all! Here in the south we say that breakfast is the most important meal of the day. So today I'm going to show you how to put the best spin on the regular breakfast that you're probably making at home already. It's going to taste extraordinarily and going to look so beautiful and very practical to eat. Let's do it! Looking at these ingredients you're probably thinking, well I know what he's going to do, but we're going to put a super cool twist to it. The ingredients we're going to need today is two slices of bread, as well as two eggs, two slices of cheese and some ham. I'm going to use the brown sugar ham. We're going to start by taking the bread and cutting the hole in it of the size of the cheese approximately. It doesn't have to be precise, uh, but just a square like that, maybe even rectangular. There we go, same with the other bread. And we're about to take this creation to the cooktop. I'm going to set the cooktop to medium, medium high and drizzle some olive or grape oil on it. You can use canola oil if you prefer. When the pan is nice and warm, we're gonna throw the breads on top of it with the even side in the middle. I'm gonna put a couple more drizzles of grape oil in it and I'm gonna crack my eggs in it. Your wife is gonna be super impressed with that. Put a little bit of salt and pepper on the egg if you'd like and then you throw the ham on top of it. Just like that to make sure it fits in nicely. We want to make sure the ham fits into the square we cut through and we throw the cheese on top of it. You want to make sure it comes off and it does. So then we're going to grab our parts of bread and put it on top of it. Push it in just a notch. The smell from the ham, the egg and the cheese is beautiful. Mm. We're about to flip it over. Mmm, nice and golden. You want to make sure the other side is nice and golden as well, so you can put a little bit of oil, oil and give it a spin. Make sure the middle bread actually gets golden on the oil as well. And it's time to take it out. This omelet or a sandwich, whatever it's called, it's super delicious and beautiful. Your wife is going to be impressed. You can decorate it with some greens, onions, parsley, whatever and then just grab it like that and take a bite. But if you're a real matcha, you take one on top of the other and then you take a bite. Unless you're married, then you have to share it with your wife. So what you do is you grab a couple of toothpicks, pink for her, blue for me, of course the better part goes to her and then you cut, cut it right in the middle. Mm -hmm. You start from the middle and go to the corners. This way it's gonna stay nice and fit. Mmm, look at that. Mmm, -hmm, it's beautiful. The yolk is nice and runny, the cheese is nice and melted. And that ham, the brown sugar ham is just mwah. And then you take the sandwich, give the best part to your wife and eat the rest. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is so, so good. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I encourage you to do it for your loved ones. We'll see you next time. Taste extraordinary. It's gonna taste extraordinary. Extraordinary. It's gonna taste extraordinary. It takes ex it's gonna taste extraordinary. I'm waiting for you. Your wife is gonna be super impressed with that. With what, Dim? I would do so much better. Oh my goodness, macho, real macho. Давай, 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 давай. Тебе нравится? Да.